prize giveaway. But for now, we're going to send it over to someone. When he's gone, he's got big shoes to fill, or we've got big shoes to fill. But you're, you're looking at all kinds of shoes, Jamie, there at Bata Museum. How's it going? Yeah, right now I'm working on a little bit of a sketch, and I'm a little bit intimidated because I'm sketching this next to world-renowned painter Marco Sassone. Uh, his boots and other works, that's the exhibit down here uh, at, uh, at the Batashu Museum. And we're doing a little bit of a sketch-off, uh, and, we're, paint and we're, we're, we're sketching each other's shoes. shoes. So he's doing his. Um, clearly, yours has this artistic uh, look of a, a guy who's been doing this a long time. And mine looks like a child from grade two who could probably well, do a little bit better. I think it's promising. It's <laughs> you so, know? so here's, uh, this is what I was working with, Mark. Yes. I, I, I was looking with, you yes. know, the texture of the shoe, the, the hash marks of it, the design. It, it, it's particularly interesting here mm -hmm. that uh, you were trying to copy the fabric of the shoes <laughs> and uh, you did it with the lines it, uh, is yeah. that is that a good technique yeah that's very good yeah very any, good. any any other suggestions you think i can i can do to to beautify well, this maybe the laces were the laces were uh, tough uh, uh, i'm not gonna lie could, could have been a little uh, um you know more rigid improvement uh, yeah okay uh-huh See, this is what this is. This is something I don't get every day. Is yeah. is personal and, uh, lessons <laughs> from a world-renowned painter. And by the way, he's not only a world-renowned painter. He was knighted by the Italian president. You got to tell me a little bit about that. I haven't met too many people that have been knighted. What was that like for you? Well, uh, it happened in 1982, and uh, I was knighted by the president of Italy uh, for the. I guess the painting and the artwork that I was doing in California. Mm -hmm. And uh, it took me by surprise, actually, myself. You know, I called my father and I go, I received this knighthood from the president. And uh, he was almost in tears. Uh, Amazing. Uh, yeah. Must have been a so, proud moment for you. Yeah, it was. Uh, can, can I ask you, what is it about Italy? I mean, we've had so many of these incredible painters, musicians, dancers, uh, literary writers. There's so much talent that comes out of Italy. What is it about the country that produces well, such great artists? The epicenter of the Renaissance and the art world at the time, from the 1300 to the 1500, was Florence, Italy. For some oh, reason, problem. Uh, which we still don't know yet, why the likes of Leonardo da Vinci, Michelangelo, Giotto, Cimabue were born all there. Not only that, scientists, uh, um, astronomer, Galileo Galilei, all throughout the Renaissance. So Maybe uh, it's something in the water. Who knows? Um, or maybe it's in the wine. I doubt about the water. I think it maybe, 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 maybe it's, it's the, the wine. Can't be wine. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, we're going to get back to work here. And don't forget, you want to come check out this uh, amazing exhibit by this incredible artist. You have plenty of time. It runs until September t uh, 5th. In the meantime, let's get to work, shall we? Oh, okay. Okay. Sure, why not? Why not? Think we, we... See, I already see what you did with my laces here. You made it a little bit more defined. So basically.